Uh, hello, everyone. So nice to have you join us today. Um, I've been invited to share just a brief experience of what it's like to be in a online lecture with Ryerson. And so I want to share with you a little snippet of the Ryerson mission statement, because for me, this is the part of Ryerson that I most connect with. Ryerson University has a very long mission statement, but here is my favorite piece of it. They talk about, we offer programs that are a balance between theory and application. And for me, that's the magic of Ryerson. Some universities are very theory-based and some places are very application-based, but my experience at Ryerson is that we are this lovely balance between the two. That in the classroom, we teach the theory, like why we do what we do, but then we also apply it to real world problems so that when you leave our walls, you understand the theory, but also what to do with it outside of Ryerson. And for me, that's the magic of Ryerson and part of what I love so much about it. So I teach the food service operation and control, which is a first year course. And then the service design is a third year course. And for me, that's the perfect combination because I get to see students in their first year and I get to meet them and I get to know them. And then they go when they have their second year. And then in third year, I get to see them again. And when we hit that third year classroom together, that for me is the real magic because you've had two years to get to know the system. And I know you because we've had our first year class together. And then it feels really magical because then you know you have grounded in the foundation and we work at things like you are in your third year of business school and now let's use that creative brain and figure out what is something you want to bring to market that doesn't exist yet and how would we design that and how would we make that a reality so that's what i teach here at Ryerson. this afternoon uh, I was teaching my first year course. And so um, my afternoon course on Monday afternoons, I have uh, 65 students in it. And we were having a discussion in my class. And I said to my group, group, this afternoon, I am meeting with like potential future Ryerson students. A year ago, most of you were in high school trying to figure out where you want to go. I take that back. I have a handful that were also in a college coming over. Um, I said, what, what would you have wanted to know? Now that you're a year in, what would you have wanted to know? And what they said was, when they were in high school, what their counselors told them was that someday you're going to go to university and you're only going to be a number. And no one is going to know who you are and you're not going to connect with other people and you're just going to be a number. And their feedback was that that was not their experience that they, even though they have been online, they have connected with other students and they have made friends in the online community and they don't feel like they're a number. And I didn't, I didn't know that counselors said that, um, but that was what they asked me to take to you, which is they're one year into their program and they don't feel like they're just a number. They feel like they've joined a community and they feel like they've connected with other people. And I was like, don't you want me to talk about my amazing lecturing skills? And they're like, no, tell them that they're not going to be isolated and lonely and that they're not a number and it'll feel like they're a community and it's going to be okay. I'm unsure of what I want to do in the future. How can I make my experience in Ryerson meaningful? Number one thing, get involved, um, reach out, connect with uh, the different support services, but also get involved in student groups and attend different events as well. So those are ways to help you kind of find yourself, um, find what you're passionate about. Not everybody knows what they want to do when they enter university. Should you have any further questions after this session, we are always available to help. You can get in touch with us through our service hub by email phone, social media, uh, there's a live chat function, or if you go to ask.ryerson.ca, that has a lot of um, answers for a lot of questions there as well. On behalf of Ryerson University, thank you so much for joining us today. We hope to see you at future open house sessions, at future webinars, and as a part of the Ryerson family or the Ryerson family. Take care, everyone.